Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a challenge that many Laravel developers encounter. Our viewer is trying to understand why a Laravel Dusk test fails on Travis CI and wants to replicate the Travis CI environment locally. The goal is to provision a full VM environment that mirrors the settings in their .travis.yml file, specifically using the trusty distribution with sudo required. Let's dive into how we can achieve this on Mac OS X. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video. Cheers. To provision a Travis CI full VM environment locally on Mac OS X, we first need to install VirtualBox. This software allows us to create and manage virtual machines. Next, we will install Vagrant, which is a tool for building and managing virtual machine environments. You can install it using Homebrew by running the command shown on the screen. Now we need to set up a Vagrant file that specifies the configuration for our VM. Create a new directory for your project, and inside it, create a file named Vagrant file. In the Vagrant file, we will define the box to use, which should be Ubuntu Trusty. Add the following lines to your Vagrant file to configure the VM. Finally, to start your VM, run the command Vagrant up in your terminal. This will create and provision the VM according to the specifications in your Vagrant file. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Travis CI support indicates that provisioning the PHP VM locally on OS X is currently not possible. They do not have further instructions for this. Theoretically, you would need to provision the Travis CI Sugalite cookbook locally. A good starting point is the Travis CI Packer Templates README. In my case, I resolved the failing build by utilizing the new debug job feature. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To provision the Travis CI PHP VM locally, start by setting the LD library path. This is similar to the path variable, but for libraries. You can do this by using the command LD library path equals your home lib directory, followed by exporting it. Additionally, remember that libs and ld flags are environment variables that affect how the configure script compiles. You can find more details by running bash configure with the help option. Lastly, don't forget to set the library path as well. It's important to understand the difference between ld library path and library path. And that's it guys. We've worked through, gone through your question, hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, you need technical help. I hope you have a good one. Cheers.